Well, on, guys, I've got some good news for uh, the Titans Returns toy line. Uh, some official images, uh, link in the description, to uh, the Sabertron, the Ultimate Transformers fan site. We have got some leaks for new Titans Return toys and the reveal of TAV50 Power Surge Optimus Prime, which is Takara's version of the leader Power Surge Prime that we'll be getting here in the States pretty soon. So, first thing we're going to go over is the Titans Return stuff. And there will be photos at the end of the video covering all of it. So let's start the video for the Titans Return stuff. And I'm pretty excited. Uh, there's uh, some characters that we already know about due to BotCon and past conventions. Mind Wipe, Wolf Wire, Weird Wolf. Uh, but we've actually got some new characters. We've got about six new characters coming our way. One of them, two of these characters, I'm actually really happy that we're getting now. So, let's start with the Transformers Generation Deluxe Titan Wars series. Wave 1 of 2017. So, I don't know when uh, all this new Titans Return stuff is supposed to come out for the rest of this year. Maybe by the end of the, by October, November, we should start seeing some of the G1 dudes... I don't know. But, the first reveal is Transformers Titan Wars Deluxe Class Hot Rod. We're getting a new Hot Rod! Yes! But here's the thing about that. I'm excited for this figure, and I hate the character so much. Because he's the reason Optimus Prime died in the 86 movie. And for some reason, I have Orion Pax sitting here with me. But anyway... We are getting a Headmaster version of Hot Rod. Does that mean we'll get an RC out of it? I don't know. I really don't know. We've got the Generations RC, which I am fine with that figure. I need to still get it. But we're getting a Hot Rod figure, which is fantastic. Uh, the next couple of characters, I have no clue who they are due to... Um, Sorry, give me a minute. Ads are popping up and my mouse is being a stupid. Sorry about that. Anyway. Now, again, I know really nothing about the Headmasters series. <clears throat> I was introduced to the Headmasters back in Transformers animated with the Headmaster unit. Uh, and I know about Fort Max. Anyway, so we're getting, uh, actually before I get to the next set of deluxes, I predicted this was coming, I predicted this, for Titan's Return, we are going to get a possible Voyager class, a leader class version of Six Shot. Yes! We are getting Six Shot! I can recreate the scene from the Headmaster series where Six Shot killed Ultra Magnus. We're finally getting Six Shot! Now, if he was going to transform into all six of his modes, I don't know. He is a headmaster unit, so that'll be good. So, the next couple reveals are interesting. Um, the first thing is Decepticon Deluxe Class Trigger Happy. He looks like a military fighter type jet. I don't know. Uh, none of these guys have official reveal dates. And the source from Sabertron is, uh, the Weebo Dude. That Weebo Dude is all over the place. I... <laughs> but we're getting Six Shot, or Trigger Happy. The next, uh, figure is Autobot Double Cross. Oh, wait a minute. Reveal dates. 2-7-16. That's right around Toy Fair, wait, 
two seven. Oh, that's this year. <laughs> I thought that was next year's back on or whatever. But we're getting Double Cross, who is apparently an Autobot dragon. And his hands are dragons. That's going to be odd. I'm going to skip these two and talk about these that last. And then we're going to get a redo of Chrome Dome into Getaway. I don't know, but two of these, vo and these, all these guys so far have been Deluxe Classes. So these two reveals are Voyager Class. First off, we are getting Titans Return, Voyager Class, Optimus Prime. Yeah, we're getting another Voyager Prime. But this one looks more like his G2 self that uh, got turned into Robots in Disguise Scourge. The Prime with the weird, his shoulder, his truck shoulders on top of his arms. Yeah, we're getting that version of Optimus here. I don't know when in the, where currently in the Prime Wars trilogy, he goes from being a combiner back to his G2 form. I don't know. Prime's gone through a lot of upgrades. Um, next, in the final Titans Return reveal that I am stoked for. Because I'm thinking, we all the Decepticons that we're getting so far. Leader Class Soundwave, Voyager Class Galvatron, Voyager Class Astro Train, Deluxe, Skull Smasher, and Mind Wipe, and Trigger Happy. We are getting a Titans Return Voyager Class Megatron. Megatron comes back to us as a Voyager Class now, and he's still a tank. It's still his uh, Combiner Wars body, but as a Voyager now. So now you can have a proper Voyager class Megatron. And I'm so happy for this. And they're gonna, uh, all of them are going to come with stickers again. Uh, the, la the only character to come with stickers last year in Combiner Wars was Leader Megatron. He comes with his fusion cannon and then a handheld gun. Why do they always give Megatron a handheld gun? I don't get that. But it looks awesome. At the end of the video, there will be photos of what these guys look like. If you'll give me a second, I'm going to transfer over to the Transformers Adventure toys now. TAV50 Power Surge. Optimus Prime, people. Give me a minute if it will work. Basically, if you guys remember Hasbro releasing images of the Robots in Disguise Power Surge Optimus, which I guess is for that movie that's coming out for Robots in Disguise when the show ends. Um, there will be photos for, of that Prime at the end of the video. But I thought I'd give you guys my overall thoughts on the Takara version. And, oh, I want it. I want the Takara version. Optimus looks too much like an angel here. And I should know everything about angels because I'm stuck watching Supernatural. Oh my god, this Prime looks gorgeous. This is basically his Season 2 body with a couple upgrade bits. It's the same figure, but... Oh, he looks so good. His entire chest is red with a couple of white paint apps. Oh, he looks so good. He still comes with this eagle pterodactyl. They're calling it a pterodactyl minicon. Which, I don't know why they're calling it a pterodactyl minicon. But, yeah. that I think that's about it for this video. If you guys want to see more news videos, let me know in the comment section down below. I'm going to get this, these photos prepped. Hope you guys like this video. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. All the fun stuff. Check out my channel, of course. Check out Scott and Miss Prime Toy Editor Production and my buddy, the new friend of Miss Prime. Links in the description for both of their channels. I'm going to get out of here, guys. Later.